So get this, everybody. The guy developing the experimental Ebola treatment has joked about culling humanity. It doesn't get much creepier than this. Yeah, this is really creepy. This is Dr. Charles Arnson of Arizona State University. He's the guy who's behind growing vaccines and tobacco plants for DARPA. He's also the guy behind the experimental treatment that was given to the Ebola-infected Americans they flew in. And he's also this guy that we reported on back in July 2013, joking about culling large swaths of the population with a genetically engineered virus. And he's one of these elite scientists in the cutting edge of bioengineering who are using it to develop things like edible vaccines. He was going to create a banana vaccine to give to the third world. He had a bunch of Rockefeller Foundation funding and so forth that would have medicine grown into the plant or the fruit. And you can use basically any medicine. And speaking of growing things into plants, he's also worked with Dr. Mitch Hine of Epicite. Not sure if you guys remember Epicite, but they were really popular back in the early 2000s because they were growing pharmacorn, genetically engineered corn, with anti-sperm antibodies in it. And of course, he's also worked for DARPA. One of the things he did is work on stockpiling an anthrax vaccine or an anthrax treatment for the military. But his words at this lecture here are just sick. It's incredible what he said. Listen to his response about should we feed the world when there's 8 billion people? And uh, should we concern ourselves with feeding 8 plus billion in the first place or should we allow natural forces of carrying capacity to affect or should we let disease, war, and pestilence wipe people out? So, thoughts on this? Has anybody seen contagion? contagion? <laughs> That's the answer. Go out and use genetic engineering to create a better virus. Oh. <laughs> 25% of the world population is supposed to go in contagion. Five thousand deaths in the. That's so funny, isn't it? Oh, and so he's literally ripping the plot from a Hollywood thing where they use martial law in the wake of a huge epidemic. Either way, this guy is working on the treatments for Ebola. I Let's mean, this, this is happen. the last person on the face of the planet that you want joking about creating a genetically engineered virus to wipe out large amounts of people. The guy who's now working on the new fast-tracked through the FDA Ebola treatment to treat the Ebola virus, we've shown you before in our reports, is being caused by the Ebola version that our CDC has a patent for. Yeah, trust that guy. Trust mm. him. Uh huh. Has anybody seen Contagion? <laughs> That's the answer. Go out and use genetic engineering to create a better virus.